All right, action. Again. What do you think about my hair? Again, look? Yes. Bing bong. You see these dogs in your front yard? Huh. Oh, what's up? Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. I want to give you guys an update on Diddy's hair. Check this out. Whoa, bro. Are you XXX and Tashian? I might be. It's kind of cool. What's the inspiration behind this X? I think it's X because he's the first one that I see and then a lot of people start doing it later on. So I just wanted to follow basically what he uh, did on his hair, his dread journey, because I, I like what he did. Because he went from uh, this hairstyle to having a blue. Mm -hmm. And then from blue, he went to platinum. Platinum? That was pretty clean. Platinum, silver, something like that. In the future, I think I think about different colors and stuff like that, inspired by Gucci uh, hair color. Or a Gucci hair color. A Gucci hair color. Welcome back to another video of Activerse Universe. And today is a new day. And we got a what? We got a banger. 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 Let's go. Let's go. All right, guys. Today, got wifey right here. I'm going to be stripping away mm? the hair. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You gonna do the video? No. You no. wanna take over? No, thank you. Okay. I'm gonna be stripping away my hair bleach. Not bleach, but color. We have our Beauty Sally's. I believe they sell this thing that removes just the dye by itself. If not, I think Target should have it or Walmart or something like that. So I'm gonna go get that today. And I'm gonna take you guys with me also so you guys can learn in the future if you bleach your hair, how to take it off right away like that. I'm getting it ready basically for my next hair color. Uh, this is a surprise also. I know that a green caught y'all off guard. I'm also. excited. You're excited? Yeah. But without further ado, let's get into intro. I want to thank the sponsor of this video. I have featured this company right here on the last video when I added an extension to my hair. My hair dreadlock is not fake guys, it's real. But I added two sets of extension on my hair to test the durability on these dreadlocks and plus recommend to you guys for those of you guys that want to see what you got, what you look like with dreadlocks to get this. And if you're a loctician also, this is one of the best thing I've ever had. It comes with a 4B hair type with different textures and length and this is the fullness of what they have sent me right here. As you guys can see in the white color, that is the stock A. 8 inches to 18 inches and the link should be in the description for that. And then you see it on the red is the stock B. And it is 0.8 centimeter thickness. And also they have a different sizes and different colors for that. And then they have a 0.6 centimeter also if you want a thinner, which is the color green. And then we got the Afro Kinky Bulk for dreads, which you can apply for any thin dreadlocks, any external additional hair. If you have a thin hair that's struggling, you need this buddy. Go get it. Be sure guys to check them out on the link in the description. They sell through Amazon. Very trustable very trustworthy company and you will see by the review how great this is like I said it's basically the texture of my hair right now so it blends in really smooth as you guys know an attempt to remove the color that's already on my hair I went into Walgreens looking for this one item called oops corrector see somebody had recommended me this before with draw locks and so I trusted a brand I trusted the person and it completely failed me as you guys saw in the last two videos I have been recovering my hair my draw locks for the past week after using this product that I bought that literally ruined my hair I have vowed to destroy this company's name and I'm gonna call them out on every video cuz it ruined my hair it is called oops correction and it ain't it especially if you have a 4b hair type kinky hair with dreadlocks don't do it my guy since they don't have bleach in that product to make up for it I believe they use some weird chemical that made the whole thing smell bad and I'm telling you I rinsed out my hair for 20 minutes and more and that smell can never come out of my hair it's still lingering till this day. To this day! To this day! 
computer, on my camera, in my house, in my bed. We had to literally sleep with a mask on after using it. What kind? I mean, who makes stuff like this? After you make a product, you should be able to smell it and say, heck no, the same for the people. Even if it does the job, what kind of smell is this, man? It smelled like a orange zest, citrusy, acid, liquid, carbonated water. It smelled like a swamp, the bottom of a trash can, trash can juice. I can't even tell you the stomach ache that it gave us. Oh my goodness, this ain't it at all. But this is few days after that. But at the same time, I basically failed. I put out a video being vulnerable, showing you guys that I really couldn't do it. <sighs> Alright guys. I ruined my dreadlocks. I could not give up at the same time. If I set out something to do, I will do it. I have to do it. I can't quit. I can't give up. Hopefully the last video really motivated you guys to continue pursue your dream, your goal, whatever you have planned for your life, especially what God has planned for your life. And then anything that goes along with that. So, you know, this is what I do for work. And so, hey, I cannot fail. God is with me, man. I cannot quit because I am not a quitter. Nothing is impossible to those that believe in Christ. So I decided to pick my butt up off the floor and get my butt to work. Yes, guys, I went back to redo the whole thing again, but this time it was with a bleach. I applied the bleach and it came out flawless, amazing. Recovery was great. And I've been for the past few days putting some oil and conditioner in my hair so that it can help it strengthen my lockup but the only thing that I'll tell you with this is don't touch your roots do not touch your scalp because the bleach is permanent on your hair once it gets on your hair guess what a bleach it took the melanin out the color is out of your hair and so you can't get it back so for a lot of you guys that think that there's a way back to your original melanin hair color no and this is why I don't advise people to use it on their scalp because you are literally constantly hitting your skin and your skin Skin reacts pretty bad to this your skin is already hot and bleach activates and heat and when you put it on your scalp you get in twice more powerful than a regular bleach on a on the side of your hair or on the tip of your hair all right right now I'm about to go get the dye that I need for the coloring process we're dying it of course Gucci color or Christmas quote-unquote all right I'm listening to you man god dang it I got it ah so we're gonna go with beauty Sally's with long dreadlocks I just got to Beauty Sally's. Oh, no, no, I'm looking for a, like a, a coloring. So 602382. Actually, it's 832, not 382. Okay. Okay, let's do these two. Okay. That'll be really pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. We already have a good base going as well. Yeah. Yeah. I, I had green before this. Okay. My whole hair. So half of it is already green. So I just need to apply the rest of it on there. Got and then it. I bleach these ones. Right here, I have two bowls. I'm going to be putting this hair color in one of them and then the other one and the other one the other one and the other one so this is a color that i noticed that gucci hair color uh color the color scheme matches towards it same with this green uh the gucci color matches it with the sliding it doesn't look that way but it actually is pretty green it looks cyan or some kind of weird color on the camera but right here is green the link should be in the description this is a frost green and is this is a dark red I'm done with the red. All right guys, I put this in the bag. Last time I used a green also, and I'm gonna be utilizing the rest of this. It came out amazing. As you guys seen on the first time when I got it right now, it just looks, you know, weird. But the first time I got it, it looked amazing. I'm gonna be using the same thing as that, and I'm gonna add this to it. This is forest green, and this is panthem green. So whatever color comes out, that's what I'm gonna rock with. But I loved this color right here. Now I got that hair in a bun on both sides. So this is a green. This is the uh, this is the red. 
and I don't want them to touch and I'm gonna be cutting my hair while that's that happening because I'm rushing to leave I have church to go to so god dang bro like this is what I look like right now boy so let's get into it before and after this is the before this is the after of what it looks like I told y'all I told y'all man I look different once I get that cut you feel me got paint on my nail I'm gonna take off the brown or I'm gonna take off the red right now wash it off and see what that ends up looking like Babs, yeah? close your eyes. Okay. All right, action. Can, what do you think about my hair? I can look? Yes. <laughs> the red looks kind of scary. <laughs> it's like fresh blood red, but with the green, it looks really Christmassy. I love it. I need to see it more together though, because I just see red. There we go. That looks good, sugar. Merry Christmas. I love it. Yes, sir. Ski, let's go, man. You did? Let's go, man. You did? Let's go, man. You did? <laughs> We was able to do it, guys. Y'all never doubted me, and I'm thankful for that. Some of y'all did doubt me. It is what it is. Take this L, my guy. Hold this L. Yeah, give me that dub. Ooh. Put a W in the comments below, because we were able to rock it and do it. I'm going to show you my full hair right now. And actually, it came out more than I even expected. This is the Gucci color slash Christmas look to it. I'm going to do a whole review on this hairstyle, on the inspiration, where it came from, and everything like that on Pineapple World. So if you guys have not subscribed to Pineapple World, make sure you subscribe. It is the second channel that I have that I review hair, of course. Talk about the things that are going on in the lock community and different things around you your journey so make sure you guys go check that out let's get into what this is though come on man quit playing with me quit playing with me man <laughs> this is the firest hairstyle you ever seen in your life and I know you know it you know what I'm saying so hit the like button man but without further ado let me just show y'all man and I'm gonna turn up in a little bit also so this is overhead what it looks like if I were to rock it like this ponytail Looks like this. Man, go ahead and hit the like, man. <laughs> Inspiration. Long time ago, I've said this on uh, Glint of the Grace channel. Let's see if I can find it when I said that I'm gonna get this hair color and I'm gonna put it right there. So if I can find it, I'll put it right here. In the future, I think I think about different colors and stuff like that, inspired by Gucci uh, hair color. Or oh, what's the name? Oh, uh, like Lil Pump, Pump when he had his Gucci. This is two years ago when I said that, and I was able to accomplish it, man. If I set out my mind to do it, man, I get it done. Next year, it is my goal to hit 100K on Activerse. So I'm planning some things out. I'm going to a business conference this Sunday or this Friday and Saturday. So that whole day, I'm gonna be strategizing and. Uh, yeah, I'm excited. This is with the hair down. This is how I was rocking it yesterday. Yes, guys, it is definitely mission accomplished. Thank you for those of you guys that motivated me. This is Activist, and I'm out. I'm about to turn up right now. Watch this highlight clip right here of me turning up. That is. Oh. 